guys what's up everybody i hope you all doing fantastic you guys i'm doing fine my name is Masi, and in case this is your first time on this channel thank you for clicking i do make content about lifestyle of a stay-at-home mom that's cooking cleaning homemaking and my latest addition which is skincare so I'd really love it if you stuck here <laughs> literally please subscribe and give this video a thumbs up so today we are doing yet another skincare video well not really a skincare video guys i had a purpose to do this video last month when i bought all this product because um on my birthday i decided to gift myself a whole skincare products that i need like for the whole uh for all my skincare and if you don't know what i'm talking about you can check my other video the first video that i did on skincare which uh where i was talking about the foundations of skincare or the basics of skincare which is basically to clean treat and protect so today i'm going to be showing you the products that i bought uh for my birthday i gifted myself these products because i really wanted to start to have a stable skincare regimen and um to just take care of my skin but honestly <laughs> today is not even the perfect time to do this because as you can see i have um a pimple here this is a viral pimple uh i think i'm almost catching a cold i can feel it coming so this is this this is because of cold and then you have this one here and right here another pimple uh, there for my period it's not a thing of concern because for the pimple i for the period it just comes and within uh, three to five days it disappears without leaving any mark so it's not a skin condition and this one it's flu so it's just going to disappear once i that phase is over so that one should not concern you okay higher so i'd encourage you if you have not watched the other video please check it out so that you can know why i bought myself these products that i bought what informed that decision and also because i'm not here to tell you to buy these products no especially in the treatment phase we said you have to tailor it towards your specific skincare needs so i'm not advising you to just copy me uh just watch the other video and then you'll be able to learn how to come up with your own skincare regimen that is suited towards your skin hope you enjoyed the video and let's get started so we said the first step skincare is very very easy i keep on telling you that we just have three steps cleanse treat and protect so for cleansing this is the cleanser that i use uh this is a new one i've not opened this one yet because the other one is not yet over it's the bayor or biore <laughs> i'm not sure uh bayor uh free your pores charcoal cleanser and they say it's great for oily skin and this is because uh it has one of the ingredients that it has is salicylic acid uh, your skin is very oily and acne prone. This is a very good cleanser. But personally, I love it because of the charcoal. And it has, I think because of the salicylic acid, it has like a like effect, like a, a very nice effect when you're using. So I really love to use, I love using this uh, cleanser. I've used it for about a year now and I love it all these skincare products are actually available in kenya but i thought better to send my sister who lives in the us uh because they are cheaper <laughs> there but anyway yeah. the next step actually after cleansing to treat so for me in the morning what are you so here we said this is where we have um actives active ingredients and so this is especially one phase that you don't want to copy from anyone because you want you want to have a treatment phase that is targeted towards your skincare needs some of these skincare concerns that i'm talking about may be acne hyperpigmentation eczema aging skin wrinkles dark spots you know so you need to choose a treatment phase that is addressed that is addressing your skin condition okay so personally the only thing i would want is to make sure my skin doesn't have wrinkles <laughs> i 
don't want premature aging and wrinkling so what i use is this the ordinary caffeine solution so it's the ordinary caffeine solution five percent plus egcg egcg is basically green tea this is how it looks so it comes in this amber bottle and then there is like this dropper when you're applying to your skin so i use this in the morning and that's because caffeine and green tea and especially green tea it's a very strong antioxidant on the package it has it's written it reduces appearance of eye contour pigmentation and puffiness so if you have like puffiness around here um and dark circles around your eyes it's very good and green tea contains polyphenols that are very powerful antioxidants antioxidants basically help to fight free radicals and they also reduce fine lines and wrinkles so i really love this product green tea can also help repair sun damage it has a calming effect and reduces irritation so this is the serum that i'm using in the morning this caffeine serum now we come to protect for protection we said you use sunscreen you use moisturizer and then sunscreen so the moisturizer that i use is the V daily moisturizing lotion this one is for normal to dry skin guys i told you my skin is normal type so this one works really well i love the fact that it has three essential ceramides and hyaluronic acid and it also is also non-comedogenic meaning it doesn't uh clog your pores and it is fragrance free remember in, a, in the previous video we said uh fragrance don't really belong to skincare you don't need a, a, a sunscreen or a moisturizer that smells like strawberry let a moisturizer just smell like that <laughs> you know it's natural smell so i love this pack because uh, number one you just press here like sika my layer puchota ivi and i love the way it applies it's just like a normal lotion like nothing nothing complicated about it i had already moisturized guys you have normal to dry skin you can get yourself this moisturizer it is really really good and i love it i've loved the uh um experience of using it i've been using it now for about a month and then once you moisturize so you start by moisturizing once you moisturize you come to sunscreen so initially uh, actually before my birthday i bought this sunscreen this is the la roche posay anthelius 50 plus spf so i bought this um it's a chemical sunscreen i loved it but honestly i think for this this goes for around 2500 <laughs> and it's really tiny so i i it's it's not something sustainable for me at this moment uh we said if you're getting into skincare make sure you buy products that you know are sustainable you'll be able to be buying them every other month if need be because it's a lifestyle you know so you you don't expect to use sunscreen once and then once this bottle is over you're like ah nilisha to me a sunscreen no it's not going to help you have to use it every other time so it's important to get something or a product that is within your price point so that you're able to purchase it every other time that you need it or whenever it runs out so i loved it but i think it's too expensive for me uh actually it's not yet over <laughs> my husband loved it more so i told him you know you can use that one and let me try explore i bought this alba botanica mineral sunscreen i'm going to do a, a video on sunscreen and just give you the difference between chemical and mineral or physical sunscreen so i bought this one um it's the one that i'm currently using and i'm going to give you a review on it 
in a, a separate video so that is like how i uh, i do my morning routine cleanse cleanse treat and then protect okay at night what i do is cleanse i use the same cleanser after cleansing i use this CeraVe resurfacing retinol serum so i learned that retinol is one of like the strongest and aging ingredient out there so um it, it's not advisable that you use it when you're pregnant or breastfeeding and since i am not <laughs> This is the one that we use and all these products we actually use with my hubby. So at night we use retinol serum. I'm going to speak more about retinol because I know it's one product that is very not it's a bit complex for most people to understand. I have a video on that coming up soon to uh, be on the lookout for that. So this one reduces the appearance of post acne marks and pores and helps restore and protect skin barrier and improve skin smoothness and it also helps to fight premature aging the other product that i i use i do exfoliate actually i've not even started using it i'm going to tell you why i bought this lactic acid five percent plus ha this is a mild lactic acid uh, for superficial it's a superficial peeling formulation i've actually never used it this is how it looks it's from the ordinary uh, so this one is basic it's for exfoliating i have not used it yet by the way so i can't give you like a complete review of this product but i'm going to be using it to exfoliate my skin and as we continue you're going to learn why i prefer chemical exfoliant as opposed to physical which is the scrubbing of the face last but not least i i bought i bought a pack another pack like two packs of this this is the camex classic lip balm it's medicated and i love the fact that it has spf as well it's the one that i'm wearing right now it's just a very basic uh lip balm no color no nothing but it lasts and it has a calming effect i absolutely love it love it love it love it especially when i'm at home just doing my stuff i love using it so the reason why i've, I've not used i've not used this CeraVe resurface, uh, resurfacing retinol serum I think I'm going to start using it this week it's because once you get yourself like this whole pack of skincare products skincare range you don't want to use them all at once because you don't know how your face is going to react to each one of them you introduce these products gradually so that if in case there's a product that is reacting to your skin you'll be able to tell because suppose now i use them all of them and i start breaking out i can't tell which specific product is breaking me out you have to introduce gradually so that uh you can learn how each product is um reacting to your skin so that in case it's causing problems you're going to drop it and uh the lactic acid uh, which i said is an exfoliant i only need to use it once a week because i want to be exfoliating once a week but i need now to first introduce this for like a week or two see how it's reacting to my skin before i introduce this one okay people are going to ask me how much will it cost uh here in Kenya, the ordinary products I've seen they're ranging between fifteen hundred to eighteen hundred, depending on what product it is. So you can say, let's say sixteen hundred, the ordinary product, the CeraVe retinol serum. Here in Kenya is retailing for retailing Allah <laughs> retailing for three thousand shillings. Um, this one is about. 2200 if i'm not wrong this one goes for 1300 here in kenya 
this one is 2500 as i said alba botanica i bought this at uh i bought it from healthy you in town for six seventeen hundred yeah seventeen hundred so with around fifteen thousand or between ten to fifteen thousand you're able to build your own skincare um regimen and some of these products like this one if you use it personally i use it only for my face you can use it for the body but i prefer to use it just for the face it's going to last us quite um maybe two months or three months so for 2200 three months i think that's a fair price yeah so those are my products that i've been using we are going to be reviewing the products one by one so that you can get more insight on them but before we review them products we are first going i'm first going to take you through those steps that we talked about last time so that's now you're able to know what you need to buy be on the lookout for that like this video and thank you for watching let me see you on the next one bye if you have comments questions just place them on the box what box the comment section <laughs> and you're going to interact there thank you for watching bye